guys, so today I have an unboxing video for you. Um, so I don't really, or I don't think I've ever done this before. Um, like I've done reviews before, but this is sort of the first unboxing that I would um, do. And, uh, or that I am doing, not that I would do, but I am doing it. Um, so I did want to um, sort of show you what I've um, gotten. <laughs> can't speak. It's so awkward. I'm so nervous. I haven't done this in a while, so I have to get back into it. <clears throat> okay. My problem is that I think I need a drink of water, but that's okay. Um, but anywho, I wanted to do this unboxing video um, today, sort of unboxing. Um, like I said before, I have actually have used these... Um, items already like once or twice one more than the other um but these are uh items that have been pretty trendy over the over the last couple or a few months actually um so i just got a hand on them oh, or two items actually the other one is a little bit older uh generation so to speak but um so anyways let me just stop babbling because I'm babbling too much and uh, let's just get right into the video. So the first one that I wanted to show you is actually um, pretty uh, cool. I'm so excited. This is, um, so I'm going to just start off by explaining that I've been sort of stocking um, the Chloe Faye bag for a while. Obviously I can't freaking buy a $1,200 purse. It's just not... <clears throat> possible for me um, so I started looking into reviews about dupes so to speak and I actually did find one I found one on Amazon and I'll, I'll link it down all below but um, I think it's pretty dead-on identical so I'll just show you unfortunately like I said I've been using I've used it like once or twice already and I threw like the dust bag away which I, my intention was not to throw it away but um, it still has the tags on and everything I wanted to show you guys, but, um, so this is the bag and it's, uh, it's just, I honestly think it's, it's just identical to the, to the Faye bag itself. I mean, the only difference is that it doesn't have the brand name on it, because that would be, like, completely illegal, but, um, but yeah, and I'll I'll put a link down below to the original Faye bag so you guys can compare and contrast there. Um, so the brand here is called L La Coutura. Oh, that's the brand. It's what it says. And um, like I said, I bought it on Amazon, and I think it was like with tax and shipping and everything. Must have been like seventy bucks. I think it came up to be so I mean compare twelve hundred to like seventy dollars it's like a lot of a difference so um so everything is pretty much the same the chain here the um, little ring here um and then the sort of um oh my god suede cover here um and then the Faybag I believe it doesn't detach this does detach itself um you don't need to detach it though to open it because it has like two buttons here to open and uh, so that's right there and then the insides so the Faye bag has um, I think three slots this one has like five which I don't really ever I don't the last two times I've used them I never use uh, the five pockets but um, so three, four, and then five, and then the inside all the way to the end has a like, um, or no, no, actually right in the middle, it has a, uh, the, the brand name on it. Um, so yeah, and then the stitching I believe is pretty much the same. I've tried to like compare and contrast as much as, as, much as I could on my own. But I think it's pretty dead on. Um, I like the price, you can't beat it. See, it still has like the plastic on here. Like, really, I haven't really used this. 
Um, and then this is the strap, and the strap on the Fay bag also has the um, these little like um, I don't know um, buttons here that you can detach and then attach. Oh, well, this one you can um, to uh, make to your own size and stuff. So pretty much, I probably use this. Oh look, it has like a little um, tag here too. I think I would use this as like to go out to dinner in the evening or out with friends, etc. Oh, it's a pretty nice little small handbag. So classy. So it comes with different uh, colors um, and sizes. I got the small, I think the Chloe Faye actually comes in like a mini, a small, and then a medium size. Um, and I think the same with the dupe. Um, and then there's the beige color and like the orange slash burgundy color that's out there. It's also pretty trendy as well. But I just, it's just timeless in my opinion. Um, and then the next thing is um, another... <laughs> Okay, so the next thing is another handbag that um, I've been trying to look into getting a Kate Spade bag for a while, but I didn't want to also spend like $300, $200, etc. And I found this one online. It was also, it was about $80 worth of a bag. And it's the small like tote bag. Um, and the name of it is, I've got it here. I wanted to remember to actually show you guys. It's called the Hat, the Kate Spade Haven Lane. Haven Lane. Um, so it's this little small tote here. It's not very big at all, but it's got the, um, the polka dots here, it's sort of glittery, but very subtle. And that's what I like absolutely loved about the bag. So this would be like an everyday bag, so to speak. Um, and then the name is here, Kate Spade. And as you can see, the polka dots are completely subtle. Nothing of a big deal or anything, which I absolutely adored. And like I said, I'm pretty petite, so I feel like this bag would be perfect for me. Um, so I'd go like on like something like that, carry it on on my shoulder. Um, yeah. Um, the inside is pretty basic. It's got um, a pocket on the side here with the Kate Spade logo on. I don't know if you can see. Um, and then two little small pockets on the inside. And the interior is pretty black. And the inside has got its Kate Spade um, authentic authenticity. Authenticity. I can't speak. Um, authenticity um, card here. Um, it just kind of tells you how to take care of it, etc, etc. Um, so yeah, I mean, that's the bag in itself. Here's the little price tag that came with it. Um, so yeah, uh, I think I got a pretty good bargain of, on this bag. Um, so if you do want to take a look or actually purchase the bag, I would leave it, i leave the link down in the bottom bar. But this is she. And yeah. Oh, and I don't have the best lighting in the room. Last thing is not a handbag. I wanted to show the two handbags at first. The last thing is the Marc Jacobs. I can't speak today. I don't know if it's because I'm nervous because I haven't done this in a while or if it's because I'm tired because it's been a pretty long day today. Um, so yeah. Um, but I'll just, I'll just show you what I'm talking about. This is her, and it's, oh my god, it's like the cutest packaging ever, honestly, no, seriously, this is, like, top-notch packaging. Um, so it's the Marc Jacobs Decadence, and look at it, it's like a little clutch all around. Look, look at this little festive stuff here, and what is it? This guy smells so good. You know what this reminds me of? It just reminds me of, I don't know, like Grace Kelly, Audrey Hepburn, very classic woman. 
seriously, like, this is a classy woman's scent. Um, it's just so, uh, how would I say, just so elegant. Such an elegant scent. If you can call a scent elegant. It's, it's just perfect. It's not too sweet, but sweet. So guys, that's it. That's all I really wanted to show you guys. Um, this uh, is pretty much uh, sort of like a fashion unboxing slash fragrance. Um, I did want to put a disclaimer out there, and I have in the past. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Um, this is pretty much like my first video after a very long time. I did start the YouTube channel back in... 2013 um, so it's been a while it's 2017 so in the midst of the new year and this being one of my new year's resolutions and it being the second week in January I did want to start off with a video and I thought an unboxing video would be like great you know kills two birds with one stone <laughs> I didn't think about that but uh, anyways, thank you and stay tuned for um, more videos. Um, I did want to kind of just start this off with something simple like this and then later on I'd kind of figure out what, what to put on here. But anyways, if you guys have any recommendations or any advice or any suggestions, please leave them in the comments down below. And um, subscribe um, if you'd like to uh, like this video. And uh, like I said, I'll put out more, more videos as the month goes by, as the year goes by, hopefully. And uh, yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Bye.